This is a complete free tutorial series for Swift Data, walking you through all its fundamental techniques in a single real world project. It's aimed at folks who have existing experience building apps with Swift UI. But all those new Swift Data APIs and techniques are explained in detail so newcomers can follow along too. You need to have Xcode 15 or later installed on your Mac. That's because the app we're building targets iOS 17 and later. Speaking of the app, it's this one right here. It's called iTour. It's a travel app to help sightseers plan their vacation. They can add various places like Rome or Venice or Verona. Then inside there, add extra text like a description or an arrival date or priority, plus extra sites they want to see inside there. There's also support for sorting and custom text-based searching. Now I designed this project specifically to cover a range of Swift data fundamentals to give you a really good grounding in how it all works. You'll learn how to design your own Swift data models, including linking them together using relationships. You'll see how to query and display data in SwiftUI, how to do searching and filtering and lots more. And of course, we're building a real world project along the way so you can see it all live in action. Let's start now. In Xcode, choose Create New Project, then choose iOS and App, and press Next. For the name, choose iTor. For the interface, please choose a Swift UI, obviously. And for storage, please choose None. Do not choose Swift Data. We're making the whole thing from scratch here so you can see exactly how it all works. Then go ahead and create that on your desktop somewhere or somewhere you want to keep your, your code. And with that, we're basically ready to go.